In our next report, we meet a restaurant owner in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, who used to love eating meat. However, he currently runs a vegetarian restaurant and has been embracing vegetarianism. Let's take a look at how he changed. Once I took a bite of my neighbor's vegetarian food and loudly claimed that it made me sick. How could anyone eat such disgusting food? It was tasteless. In the past, Ani ate only meat and disliked vegetarian food. He was a chef and opened a buffet restaurant. His wife had tried to persuade him to be a vegetarian, but it was in vain. Then it was his mother's sickness that changed him. A few months ago, his mother became sick, so we took her to a nearby clinic. The blood test showed that she had some terminal illness. So he vowed to the Bodhisattva that if his mother's next blood test turns out negative results, he'd be a vegetarian. His decision to be a vegetarian was to fulfill his vow, but it later also improved his health. Thus, An Hen Yan became more confident in being a vegetarian. After I turned 40 years old, I became sick quite often. I would get sick every month. But after I became a vegetarian, I don't become sick often. The couple now sells vegetarian food, but it also fulfills his sense of achievement. When I was selling meat, I didn't care if you came to eat it. I simply cooked it and sold it. But now I sell vegetarian food. If non-vegetarians would eat in my restaurant, I will become happy. Ang Hen Yan will use his vegetarian food to form good affinities with his customers, so more people will become vegetarians.